was young, I frequently took many visits to India to visit my relatives and family members, and I had a caretaker named Ramesh. Unfortunately, I found out that Ramesh had lost his hand in a factory incident. I really wanted to do something to help him. I wanted to use my skills in computer science and modeling in some way to provide help towards him. This eventually led me to the thought of 3D printing prosthetics. My name is Virad Jayam, and my program is Helping Hands Long Island. Our program is designed to provide 3D printed prosthetics to those who have lost a limb. The way our program works is that people see our website, see our social media, and they come into contact with us and give us their measurements. With the measurements, we edit the software for the hands and we 3D print them and make all the physical modifications necessary and send it over to our recipient. And in some cases, we personally go and deliver the prosthetic to them. Currently, the program has four different members and we work together to assemble and print the parts out. Generally, the entire process takes about a week and a half. We are available to provide prosthetics to anyone across the globe. Some of the countries that we have provided prosthetics to are the United States, the Dominican Republic, Mexico, India, and many more. From the start, Helping Hands Long Island has worked to deliver over 40 prosthetics to people across the globe. When I went to deliver the hand to Ramesh, I gave him the prosthetic and immediately he was able to open a bottle of water and drink from it with his hand and he gave me a big hug. The greatest feeling about service is seeing the reaction on people's face when you do something for them. It's very gratifying for me and it, that I'm actually using whatever skills that I have to go out and make a difference and make a change and help people. I would like to thank all the people who are part of my program, all the members that are involved, as well as my parents. And I plan to use the grant money provided by the Children's Museum in Indianapolis to investigate into biomechatronics, which is a field that is upcoming in prosthetics. I hope to better the models of these prosthetics that I'm providing to others through the research in this field. The piece of advice that I have for anybody who's looking to go into service is that anything, anything that you do for anybody can leave a profound impact on others. And I think that any service project, no matter how small or how large it may be, it still is worth pursuing. <laughs>